Welcome back to Planter Garden TV. I hope everyone is doing fine. How you all doing today? Well, today, the weather is beautiful. I mean, it's 50 something degrees. That's okay. And I went to the store. I went and looked for some seed today, some tomato seed. And that's it right up there in the park right there. And while I'm there, I saw the sweet pepper. These sweet pepper already have on blossom. Some of them already, I don't know if you see in, if you see in the blossom. All of them have on blossom and small peppers. So when I look at them, I say, wow. At this time, I need to grab some of these. Yes, it's $4 and change for one, and I can get a pack of seed for $2 and change. But what we gotta remember, the longer you have these plants in the earth, the more you gonna, they're gonna produce for you. Because when the winter come, it kills them. So you got to get them early that the, that the, the time they start bearing, you're going to get a lot of pepper. So now these pepper already start blossoming and already start bearing. So now I'm, I buy them and I said, let me plant them. Yes, I know it's still in the winter. We ain't even hit spring as yet. But guess what? It's an experiment. I never plant this early. I could even put them in the shed right there. But I'm not even going to do that. I'm going to put them in the earth. I already dig the holes them. This is the holes them I already dig. And I already show my manure inside. The manure that I use is from trees. Rotten trees. I scrape out there inside. And I use a manual. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna start this, I'm gonna start mixing. I'm gonna start mixing the dot. I'm gonna mix the dot with the manual. Yeah, in every hole. You mix the dot with the manual in all the holes them. So when you mix the dot with the manual, that's good. So you come over here. I have like six plants. Like six plants. So I dig six holes to plant them. Guys, I don't know if you're seeing, but these holes are really deep. Especially how these plants be tall already. You cannot just plant them on the top of the surface. You got to plant them real deep. Really deep. So you see, I'm pushing my hand down inside a hole. Real down inside a hole. That I can plant them. Okay? So now, we're going to take this one. But remember... You cannot damage the root. You see like this? If you damage the root right now, you have a problem. You could lose all these blossoms. You could lose all these pepper. So you have to make sure that you be very careful. I cannot damage no root here. Because I want this thing to continue growing. So I'm going to dig out. I know it's already deep, but I want it real deep down there. You see how deep? Real deep. So now I'm going to come and I'm going to take this out. I'm using my hand, so it's a little difficult, easy. I cannot damage any root for this plant. Beautiful. Beautiful. So now I place it down in there. See the blossom? 
it's already have blossom so now you see how deep it's down in the hole so now what i do now i bring some dirt around it just like that and i leave it right there it's still down in the hole it ain't even above the hole that's how you got to plant so when you plant like that the root gonna spread and the plant gonna become strong because it's deep in the earth okay next one next one so you see i'm digging it real deep because like i said you cannot bury them you cannot plant them on the surface And I cannot damage the roots down inside here again. Pull some dirt around it. Pull some dirt around it right up to the bottom leaf. You bring the dirt right up to the leaf down to the bottom. You see? Yeah. This is sweet pepper. This is the best way to plant sweet pepper. If you take your time and plant them really deep that they could produce a lot of root they're gonna bear a lot for you and at this time this is still February and I'm planting pepper with blossom and small pepper inside on top of it that's a good thing all I gotta pray now that the coldness ain't damage them But this is my first time planting pepper this early, especially when they already have on pepper. So it's just an experiment. Yes, guys, that's whole. So you see how I'm doing it? I'm not damaging no root. Everything is coming out. Look how deep down in the hole it is. Now I fold up the dirt around you see all these dry grass these you put them around and cover them with dirt that's tree right there look how they're looking beautiful as ever so once they catch you're gonna keep throwing dirt you're gonna keep throwing the dirt but right now this is it for now with the dirt so once you start growing and start getting tall, you're gonna start throwing dirt around the plant inside here. You see, I, I dig beds, not beds, I'm um, banks. I dig banks, so what I do in the bank, I go and I dig out the hole in the bank. So now if the rain come, it's not gonna wash with nothing here. It's gonna wash, it's gonna run down there. Okay, and even feed the plant. Sometimes the water settle in that row and feed the plant with that water. So this is key information I'm giving you guys here. This is priceless information. Let's go to the next one. This also is sweet pepper. It already have pepper. Already have pepper. Okay, so deep the hole is so I go down inside here and I open the hole because I want it right down to the bottom. You see how deep watch my whole hand almost in the hole. That's how deep it is. When you plant your vegetables like that, I'm telling you, they love you. They're gonna love you. All you do, you bury right up to the root, to the top, to the top, um, the bottom leaves. That's where you bury the thing right to, right to the bottom leaf. Okay, guys, so that's three beautiful pepper I plant. I have two more. So guys, like I said, these are priceless information I'm giving you. If you want your vegetables them to bear, 
follow these instructions. If you want them to bear a lot, look, look, this one have on a pepper already. If you want them to bear a lot, follow these instructions. I have some videos that shows you how much my sweet peppers bear. Oh yeah. So I'm not just telling you this because I, I want to tell you this. This is from experience. This is from experience. And the more you do it, the more you want to see exactly what I'm talking about. The more you see, the more you follow these instructions, you will be able to tell somebody else in the future what they need to do for their vegetables to bear a lot. And let me tell you something with me. Everything I plant grow. Nothing die. Everything I put in the earth, nothing die. Because I plant with love and care. And I also take good care of my vegetables because I expect to eat from them. So guys, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please like this video. Please share this video. Please comment. If you have any information you want to know, you can always ask in the comment section. Stay blessed. Be blessed. Let's get the garden together. Thank you.